Right, morning all. Uh, no, I haven't. Uh, I haven't disappeared off the face of the earth. And uh, it, it it hasn't stopped raining since we came back from Wales. It hasn't stopped raining. Anyway, as this um, uh, the thumbnail suggested, I'm doing a, a, a bit of a test really uh, using the DJI um, their own. Uh, 3.5 mil mic adapter uh, that they produce for the, the officially they show it for the DJI Osmo Action 4 um, but obviously I've got a Osmo Action 3 so I just wanted to make sure that it works properly on, uh, on, on the 3 uh, I'm also using the DJI um, lavalier mic uh, if, you, if you look back to what, I think it was about April last year when I first bought my DJI Osmo Action 3 um, I was having, God I was having loads of issues with the uh, audio being distorted um, and after watching uh, a chap on YouTube called Wayne Records I think it is, Wayne then R-E-C-S at the end um, and he was talking about using a Boya BY4 mic adapter which worked with the Osmo Action 3 um, which I found very useful but even then the uh, hammer mic that I use it's a cheap it was a cheap one off um, Amazon uh, even then the mic was too hot for the camera the camera settings um, we're just turning on to the M6 now southbound um, yeah so I ended up having I uh, watched an another uh, uh, review off a chap um, and he fitted an inline volume control designed for headphones and all it essentially did was put resistance in between the mic and the camera or mic and the mic adapter and then the camera obviously um, but with all that wiring uh, it all looked a bit it worked, it worked, don't get me wrong, it worked, it did the job, it all looked a bit, oh I don't know, Heath Robinson, a bit untidy, you know, that sort of thing. So, obviously I've been looking out for alternative options. Uh, the sound for, that I had before was absolutely fantastic, uh, you know, I, I couldn't fault it in any way whatsoever. Um, but I'm subscribed to a chap based in Lancaster called Moto UK um, and he's gone down the DJI route and uh, he was showing the this uh, DJI DJI's own mic adapter on his Osmo Action 4 um, so I asked him the question does it work with the 3 and he said he tried it in a static test as in not on the bike and yes it works so I thought well it's got to be worth a punt hasn't it it's got to be worth a go um, so that's what I've done and I think you'll agree I think it I think it looks it looks a lot neater doesn't it uh, so I've been dying to get out and test test it um, because the uh, the weather here has been absolutely atrocious. Um, I, woke this, I woke up this morning and I thought it's not actually raining hard. So we've come out and we're having a go. Now I'm going to give you the occasional wipe 
uh, because the roads are still wet and it is actually misty rain um, and I wanted to come I wanted to try this mic setup now uh, in different conditions um, Wayne I was saying about earlier on he tried to replicate I mean he the, the guy's an audiophile is that the word audiophile he, he really he really tries to get the best out of the audio um, so he tried to replicate uh, our our conditions for recording when riding motorbikes uh, you can't really do that can you no, you know not in a room uh, because you haven't got the rushing wind which is wanting to cause distortion all the time so yes you can you can uh, you can basically replicate sounds around you but the one thing you can't do is replicate the wind so I've got the loud mic um, attached in the same place as my old setup but I haven't got the dead cat on uh, the dead cat for anyone that doesn't know is like a little little furry thing that fits on top of the uh, the microphone so um, um, and the one thing that was really really good with my old setup is you could hear my uh, equal really between my voice and the exhaust note uh, now you're not going to get that on the motorway uh, especially when it's a quite a windy day like it is today um, but we're going to turn off now anyway so uh, yeah because the majority of my riding is done on B roads and unclassified roads uh, and obviously linked in with A roads um, so you've got more chance of uh, hearing everything off at junction 34 got to be a little bit careful on this bend very often a lot of diesel spills on it Look at that actually clear well not clear but bright sky up there a little VW up up my bum heading towards Lancaster. Well you would wouldn't you? <sighs> I'm going to turn right I thought what we'd do is go um, through a place called Halton so we get a mix of roads you know I'm really hoping that the, um, the, the, the audio like the mic with the uh, uh, my voice uh, mic the exhaust of my voice um, I'm hoping that they're as good as before. I'll just open my visor a minute. So you probably hear a bit of wind at the moment. Um, I've been a bit under the weather um, I've had this co uh, cold and cough um, since the uh, last week we were in Wales because Steve and, Steve and Joanne have been coughing and spluttering all the time we were there and I was bound to pick something up wasn't I and I believe they're calling this cough the 100 day cough now I've had it for what seems like an eternity now anyway um, we're in 
2020. See, it's not just Wales. Oh, let me blink an indicator on. Nasty place to put a uh, speed bump. All these uh, speed bumps and everything are new. Right, I'm going to take a left here. Oh, foundry Lane, nasty little junction. Hopefully the exhaust sounded nice there. Uh, I do want to stop somewhere to take a photo. Then we go over the motorway, over the M6. Um. One thing uh, that, that always always bugs me about my own videos is um, is that somehow we're offset, aren't we? So you see more of this hand arm than you do of this one. But I don't really think there's anything I can do about that uh, because the the camera's lens uh, on the mount junction here and we'll take a right um, yeah the camera lens is offset it's not central to the uh, camera body is it so I really don't think there's much we can do about that you still with me yep Um, obviously, I will put a link um, to Moto UK's video that he did uh, regarding this setup on the Osmo Action 4, and uh, I'll also share a link to uh, Wayne's channel. Uh, it is quite interesting. He does he does go a little bit well. He goes quite deep into it actually into audio um, but he is he is uh, a big fan of DJI um, yeah so it's worth a watch I'm absolutely amazed I haven't been coughing my head off yet there I don't think it's supposed to be there or well, it might be actually because there's a lot of ponds that aren't actually supposed to be there Get another wipe it is quite windy today and wet and horrible uh, that, and that's the only th only thing that slightly worries me about this setup. I mean, I don't tend to go out in the rain because I, I don't get any enjoyment out of riding in the rain whatsoever. Wet roads, fair enough. But when it's actually raining, no. Um, the, the only thing that concerns me slightly is this seal. It's not a watertight seal. It's, you know, it's not a waterproof seal, I should say. So it, you, you can see the block. It clicks in. Um, so there is a bit of a, a bit of a um, a gap. A mind you, a mind you gap, gap. Fair enough. I have to think for a minute where this road come out then. Right, take a right. Um, I looked at the weather forecast before I come out. 
and it's given it to be horrendous in about an hour. Back over the M6 and then to Nether Kellet. Someone's got a log fire going. Uh, what else have we got to tell you? Oh, we've got we've got loads of things planned for this year. Um, going out in Zebedee and whatever. Uh, so really, really looking forward to those. Hopefully, um, in April. Hopefully uh, nipping down to Norfolk, as if from us you could nip to Norfolk. It's a fair slog. Making a mucky mess here, aren't they? Um, and also, uh, uh, before then I think, uh, we're going to uh, between a place, a hotel between Pickering and Scarborough. Um, Clementine's coming with us, um, so hopefully uh, we'll have a bit of a bimble down there. Heartbeat country, if anyone watches Heartbeat. do with finding a gateway. So how are you finding this uh, audio? Um, like I said there was nothing actually wrong with it before. It's just I think hopefully this setup is uh, easier and uh, easier, uh, tidier and hopefully um, because it's all, all DJI and it's all compatible with each other, um, hopefully I won't get any issues like not recording audio and stuff like that, uh, which I did actually mention in one of my other videos. If my voice sounds a bit different than it normally does, it's because I'm coughing that much that um, I think I've damaged my throat. So hopefully I'm not sounding too nasally. funny there's more driz drizzle this end uh, than there was Lancaster end. That's a daft sport in it. Uh, Tame with, Tame, Mr Tame will agree, uh, disagree with me on that. <coughs> Just as I say I haven't coughed, I've got a bloody cough. Oh, diesel smell. I came off that bus. Um, just entering over Kellett. Really hope, hope the uh, uh, the mic's picking up the overrun on the exhaust. That's why pretty much why I chose this route, you know. Straight across, and we'll end up um, on the motorway bridge. We very up end, uh, often end up on. Oh, 
the housing estate popped up here, look. I don't think there will be any affordable houses there, do we? Turn left. Oh, 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 rough. Muddy. I'm going to uh, pull in here now, just take a photo. Oh God, mud. Right, I'll uh, I'll catch you in a bit. Bye for now. Right, we're back. Um, while I was there, um, if anyone watches the All Year Motorcyclist, which I'm sure a lot of my subscribers do, uh, he's been asking for people to do dance video for uh, to, to, to raise money for charity, men's health. Um, so I thought I'd just do one there. I'm a bit restricted because my back still isn't quite right and I don't want to go pushing it. is a bit mucky. What are you like? So hopefully, hopefully this setup has been a success. Uh, I've got the um, camera volume setting on minus five. Um, uh, what I was talking about earlier on about the inline volume control I had uh, making like a resistance uh, I believe that that's what the DJI I, I have basically done with this uh, connector uh, apparently they have designed it with moto vloggers in mind so uh, my, my biggest fear is that it's too sterile um, oh, I've mentioned that before about sound being too sterile when I was in ref uh, talking about uh, wireless mics There's spots of diesel on the road here uh, yeah when I was referring to wireless mics the, if you were to use the wind reduction or wind or noise reduction or whatever it's called within the camera you, you, you just lose the all the atmosphere of riding a motorcycle so we don't want to do that, do we? Um, I'll tell you what, I normally go left here and we go over the little motorway bridge, but I think we'll go straight on. Um, we'll come out by the Longlands, Longlands pub. Oh, see. I don't know if you saw that then, the horse just there on the on the junction. So I'm trying to be as quiet as I can. Oh, this cough, I tell you. Yeah. I have had enough of it. I really have. Um, but not only is the, the cough, you, 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 even now, all these weeks, I don't know how many weeks it is now, three. Uh, you end up feeling kind of light-headed as well and uh, when you have a coughing fit it really takes you out of you, it really does no it's not man flu before all you girlies uh, start telling me about man flu 
Which way should we go now? Oh, we'll, we'll head back. I haven't had my breakfast yet. Nothing coming. That's a long lunch pub. Over the motorway yet again. Right, I'll end this video now. So I hope you found it useful. I hope it worked. I really, really hope it worked. Because uh, the items are cheap. Um, I'll put a, D a link to the DJI website where you can find them. Um, but if it works, it works, doesn't it? So yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, please leave a, a, a big thumbs up if you could. That really does help the channel. If you, if, you know, it, it means that my videos are like liked. That's why there's a big thumb up. Uh, and then uh, comment, subscribe, tell me what you think. And uh, we'll see you on the next one. Bye now.